Still recovering from Tropical Storm Isel, some residents of the Big Island could soon be facing another natural hazard. We're talking about lava. These are images right now of the flow from the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory, where scientists are closely tracking lava that is now a potential concern. The flow has been on the move for the past two months and recently entered a crack on the East Rift Zone. Now, while it disappeared underground, it can still be tracked to see how far the flow has advanced. The lava is about six miles away from its source, the Pu'u'o'o vent, but only two miles from the nearest housing subdivision. And it is showing no sign right now of slowing down. Any of these flows can be a potential threat to residential areas, subdivisions to the north, uh, to the east, to the south. Uh, the farther these flows go, to just in general to the east, uh, the more communities they may threaten. Most of the lava from the East Rift Zone heads to the south, like the video clip that you're seeing, and reaches the ocean. But over the past year and a half, some flows have also moved northeast. The flow has been moving through parts of the Puna Forest Reserve, sparking some small brush fires. Because it is near homes, Hawaii County Civil Defense will now be alerting residents to possible problems in that area. Right now, it's very difficult because it's, it's very hard for HBO to predict with any degree of certainty what that track or path may be. So it could take a, a number of different turns or directions, each one presenting with different scenarios on how it could impact the community. And tonight we want to let you know informational meetings will be held at the Pahoa Community Center on Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday evening.